The Ford agenda and Bay Street's agenda has never been about finding gravy. That's what they use to spread their venom all over the damn place, to set up one person against the other, to try and exclude immigrants, to try and stir up hatred against uh, people who are marginalized and people who are low income. I don't want to fight every other desperate mom for whatever subsidies are left, because I feel I need my lab and women in jail. The attack by the Ford government is about the heart and soul of this entire infrastructure of our city and how it will be run. It has been about taking a knife to the most vital and important services that our communities depend upon. And that is why we have come here to take a stand against them and to make clear to their representative in City Hall that we are going to fight them every step of the way. And what we're doing here is incredibly important. It's called resistance. This isn't about a deficit in the budget. This is a political agenda to stop services to our community. What we need is more services, not less. We need decent, affordable, accessible transportation. It's not like another system is impossible. We already have other systems in place. In the province of Quebec, child care is $5 a day. We're telling you to keep a sticky hands off our daycare community centers. We don't want any of our services cut. You've created this crisis. This crisis was not real until you became mayor. We, this whole process is a complete and utter sham. We will not accept these cuts. We need community union coalitions and the voice of the most marginal in our communities to be heard. Stop the war on the poor, make the rich pay! We intend to mobilize the anger that exists in communities and take it to them. We intend to unite with workers in struggle. We intend to create a force in this city that is going to make the Ford agenda something that, that cannot be implemented. But once in a while, it's good to have a situation like this. This is like the heresy years where everybody got together and started fighting back. What I want my child to learn is that when shit gets prepared, people stand up for themselves. Some things are not to be tolerated, that even when odds are stacked against you, that you're going to stand up and that you're going to fight.